Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Eric Surf6 and welcome to another episode of Eric Meal Time. Today I'm in Yokohama, Japan and check this place out. Look at that. Burger Joe's Hamburger and Cheesecake. Did I read that right? Hamburger and Cheesecake? Oh my gosh, I've got to try this. French fry. French fry. And Juicy Lucy. Look at that. Wow, and hot dogs. Grilled cheese burger sandwich. Look at that. Wow. All right, are we going in? Yes or no? You know the answer to that. Next time, I gotta get this, but I've already eaten today, so. Yeah, next time I'm definitely gonna get this. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five patties, yeah. Next time, I'm definitely gonna get this. And look, not only is the burger amazing, there's craft beers right here. Look at this, it's craft beer. I mean, you can't go wrong with craft beer and burgers, can you? I mean, this is, wow. I'm just gonna have water though tonight. If you guys don't mind, I'm just gonna have water. They have shakes here too. Look at this, the ultimate. The ultimate shake, can you see that? Oh my goodness. Oh, they've got all kinds of goodies here, don't they? Look at this. Presenting the Juicy Lucy. <laughs> okay, so the total price for this is about $10. A little less than 10 bucks, not bad. It's got cheese in it. See, that's kind of a Japanese thing where they pack the cheese inside the patty rather than above it or below it and then melt it into, right, the bun or whatever it is. So it's inside the beef. Interesting, right? Yeah. Uh, Smells so good. It's gonna be amazing. This is gonna be amazing. It comes with choice of ketchup and mustard, so I'm gonna dress it with a little bit of both. Just a little bit. Let's not over let's not overdo it. Easy, easy. What do you think? That's about right, isn't it? Can you guess what this is? It's a triangle, of course. But it's also used as a holder for the burger, so you don't, just so you don't get all messy. Yeah, it's pretty thick. If you ate this barehanded, it would definitely be a mess. So let's put it in the back. Yeah, much better. Yeah, this is going to be much more manageable. Mm -hmm. Going in for the first bite, Juicy Lucy. I got mostly onion in the first bite. Oh, look at the cheese coming out. Quickly, another bite. It's a very um, creamy cheese. Like, do I want to say processed cheese? I guess all cheese is processed. Creamy. It's good. Oh, it's good. Oh. This is amazing. 
and I just sort of stumbled upon this place, right? I was lost, actually, and I was, I was walking through this tunnel in this neighborhood that I don't know, and then I popped out of that neighborhood, and there was this place. Oh, it's messy. Without this little bag right here, it, I would have been defeated. Yeah, definitely. Mm -hmm. Gotta have the bag, for sure. <laughs> oh, the cheese there. For a Japanese burger, this is a really good burger. For you know, an original place like this. Goodness, Motomachi, Japan. It's only a hundred meters from the train station. Two patties. Mm -hmm. So it's a double patty burger. Definitely has some volume. The cheese. The cheese is oozing out all over the place. I love it. <clears throat> but you know, overall, it's a pretty simple burger. Mm hmm. The onion is the main ingredient, I think. The onion and the cheese. Mm -hmm. oh. Finger looking good. Oh, no doubt about it. We'll even lick the paper here. Oh. Unbelievable. <clears throat> Man, what a treat to find this place. Let me show you these fries. You see these? Uh -huh, right there. Oh, oh, oh. Just do one at a time. Yeah. Golden, delicious fries. How long that is. Oh, boy. It's flavored just right. No ketchup, mustard, anything required. Just like this. Man, this place knows what they're doing. Mm. Clear. Oh. Yeah, those fries are spot on. Those chips are spot on. Those chips are spot on. And we're gonna have a cheesecake for dessert. Stay tuned. So this is the uh, this is the Oreo cheesecake that I just ordered here. It's been so long since I've been an Oreo. Let's go in for a bite, shall we? Oreo cheesecake. Oh boy. Hmm. Oh, it's cheesy. It's creamy. Oh my. It's really rich. Love this cream right here. Uh -huh. Where did they learn how to make this? Look at that. Look at that Oreo goodness. <laughs> oh my gosh. Incredible. Total cost for this? I don't know, I'll pay whatever. It doesn't matter. About five dollars. <clears throat> mm. Mm, fruitiness. Oh. Mm. 
Oh, love me some pineapple. Oranges as well. Oh. Amazing. This is amazing. All right, let's hurry up and polish this off. The standard Oreo right here. So the waitress asked me if I was filming a video for YouTube, and I said, yes, how do you know? And she goes, because your cell phone's sitting right on the table. Duh. I felt like an idiot. And that's the way it is when you go to, by yourself to film videos. Oftentimes, you do feel like an idiot. So, welcome to the world of idiots. <laughs> All right, we're getting down to the end of it here. This is an amazing dessert. Oh. Oh, oh Tell you what guys, I'm totally blown away by this meal. <clears throat> amazing burgers, they've got cheesecake, they've got craft beers. I mean, how can you go wrong with those combinations? Fantastic. So, I guess now it's time to rate this meal. So on my Eric mealtime scale of one to six Eric heads, I think I'm gonna have to give it somewhere in the vicinity of probably around, how many heads have I got? I'm gonna go with six, six heads. This is a full nom nom nom. It's special because I just stumbled upon this place. I mean, I. It's my goal to try to find the best food that I can for you guys and to try to find as many six star videos as I can. But a lot of times it takes some research before going and, and discovering the best food. But this one, I just sort of stumbled upon it. So score, when I score, you guys score. I score good food, you guys score, get some snack packs. So I'm giving away three of the Get Some Snack Packs. The only thing you need to do is put a comment down below in the comment section and I will announce the winners in the very next video. So thanks for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I look forward to seeing your comments. Take care guys, we'll see you next time. spilled all the silverware. Oh, sometimes that's the way it is though. It's all about the embarrassment on YouTube, isn't it? You gotta have the guts to just go in and just shoot anytime. And when you make a mistake, you gotta keep rolling. That's the way it is. You worry about it later. Mm -hmm.